Beautiful. What is going on guys? Sean here with another video. I got my little ninja bandana and I have my little new cup. It says, you do not yield. And this is from a book series that I read. It's called Throne of Glass by Sarah J. Mass. Really good book, really good series. Um, today I'll be using Dark Side. Really nice scent, rum scent, chocolate, um, coffee. Oh man, love this scent. Okay, so what are we doing today? I'm going to be shaving with this convex cortical edge. It was honed on a cortical the entire time. Bevel set and then the medium, the bevel set was at the six foot wheel. Heavy slurry. Then I went to the 25 foot wheel, lighter slurry, and then finished flat. I have gold dollar, just a normal flat cortical. This is a fine cortical. I went from bevel set again to the finish, to the dilocot method, to water only, to oil. Uh, the test on this is basically to see the quality of the gold dollar and how well it holds the edge. And here I have a Freed and Bauman 5 8 This is the smaller of the three razors. And this was honed on a slow cortical for the bevel set. And then a fast cortical for the finishing stage. Um, that fast cortical, uh, it's really fast. So I was really meticulous when I was doing the uh, final stage, cleaning that stone every 10 laps or so. So just to see um what's going on because there's a lot of information out there on cauticals different people have different opinions and i just want to make my own opinion you guys like this <laughs> all right i'm gonna get my face ready i have about i don't know two days worth of growth lately i've been leaving my growth a little higher it feels like my skin likes it all right i'll do that and i'll see you guys when i am ready to put my shaving cream on all right and we are back i have my wool fix old original badger brush here dark side shaving soap by uh hags thank you michael other also known as bema boy shaving go check him out all right, here we go. Really nice lather here. Did you guys see that UFC fight? I know. I hope that uh, Dapper Shaves saw that fight. Two Africans, Drisus Duplessis and Adesanya, Israel Adesanya went head to head. for the belt and Drisus Duplessis came out victorious with that rear naked choke. It seemed to me that he won the first round, won the second round, mind you. Mind you, he won those rounds, but they were ugly. Um, first round could have gone to either of them but I give that round to Duplessis. Second round, definitely uh, Duplessis round with the takedown that he had. And third round, uh, I don't remember what happened in the third round. I know in the second round, Adesanya said that Duplessis was tired. I think third round went to Israel. 
I think at the fourth is when the rear naked happened, rear naked choke. All right, we have a nice lather. We have a nice growth to test out these razors. Which one will I go first? I'll start with the convex. I have high hopes for this because it's convex. Beautiful, beautiful. Never disappointed. Let's do the gold dollar. Definitely not as keen as the convex razor, but still a good 10K edge right here. I have been thinking for a while that these gold dollars, the steel kind of matters in a way for Krakata glows to get the max out of them. I feel like uh, German solid blades really do uh, take a good cortical edge. Look at those nice long strokes. That is keen as hell. All right. And what is this? Is this? Yeah, this is a German Razor 5 8. This one, this is the one I'm most curious about. Because this one shouldn't work. All right. I think we improved this edge from the last time that we used it. So definitely differences between this and uh the last time that we did it last time that i used this i only used the fast cortical i think for the bevel setting the fast cortical definitely takes the win but here we use a slow cortical we set a bevel with thick slurry and then we move to a fast cortical and uh difference is this time with the finishing I uh, did the 100 laps on soapy water, and then I went to the um, to the oil, and the mineral oil really did, does a good job at bumping that edge just enough so it doesn't hit the garnets. And uh, then the heavy stropping also seems to do a really good job with these cortical edges. I'm not sure if I'm gonna upload this before the honing video or after. If I upload this after, then in that video I talk about trying out different corticals. So if you have a cortical that you think that I would like to try, my email is in the channel about section. If you want me to try out your cortical, see if it can do a one stone hone, check out my channel and then you can send me your, your cortical and I can give it a try and we can do a FaceTime and try to get to the bottom of it. Let me try this uh, convex again. Absolutely love these convex edges. I think a lot of the appeal with these cortical stones is the range that they have. 
and the comfort that they provide. You guys hear that? It's freaking smooth. So now that I know I can set a bevel on those stones, the slow one and the fast one, I think I'm gonna take it easier now and go back to my normal routine of using my synthetic stones for the bevel setting and for the Beautiful. For the bevel setting and possibly 5K, I'll do the 5K work and then jump to a cortical. That way I don't have to use as much slurry. Maybe a light misty slurry. We'll get the job done. So I think I got the basics down of the conical and now I'm gonna keep that in my arsenal know that I if I go on vacation or something and I only have one stone I can use that nick myself here and here I really should do these shorter passes They are more comfortable by the end of the shave. Beautiful work. But I kind of knew that the convex edge was going to give a good against the green. Shorter passes on the Freedom Bombing. Very comfortable. I like the long passes, they're quick, they're natural to me. I feel like they give me a good read if I have a keen edge or not, because you're going over so much area. But this is a lot more comfortable, I'll say. The shorter passes. Wonderful job here. I probably wouldn't nick myself so much if I did those shorter passes. So I'll probably do those as well.
That is a keen SOB. Yeah. Beautiful. So, I feel happy where I am at my journey with Cardical so far. I feel like the work I put in is definitely paying off. And, uh, now I'm just gonna relax a little bit, not obsess so much over them. Uh, like I said, I've gone on YouTube and I uh, go to the unwatched section of videos and I watched so many videos, like so many hours of codical footage. Uh, yeah, they were, they were driving me crazy. All right, with Boba Ice Blue. Oh yeah. I feel like conicals are the most comfortable edges that I've tried so far. Uh, I've tried JNAT, I've tried synthetic, I've tried the conical, slate. Um, I think that's, that's it, that's what I've tried so far. Um, for sure the conical, the most skin friendly edge that you'll get. Or that I've gotten. You'll get whatever you get. Um, Alright guys. Thanks for watching. I always read and reply to all your comments. So make sure you leave one in the comment section below. And I'll see you guys in the next shaving video. Possibly a DE razor shave.